Hey guys welcome back so for today's video we are going to be making a diaper cake i went to visit our newest member of the family my niece and of course i had to be a little extra with the gift so keep on watching to see how i made this you'll need rubber bands ribbon of your choice and diapers of your choice i'm using a small pack of diapers this specific pack has 29 diapers and i was able to do three layers so i'm just gonna roll the diapers up put a rubber band and do the do that same process for the remainder of the diapers For the first layer, I'm using 11 diapers. It fit perfectly around the can of formula. I knew that I wanted to add something in the middle for my niece, um, and so the can of formula, you know, fit perfect on the charger. So it's 11 diapers, and the rubber bands that I had weren't big enough, so I'm using the ribbon, the decorative ribbon, to secure this first layer together. I'm sure there's lots of different ways to assemble and make these. You don't have to add a can of formula. You can just fill it with more diapers in the middle. This is just the way that I chose to do it. For the second layer, I'm using, I think it was 12 diapers because for the second layer, I did fill in the middle and the rubber band that I did have um, on hand fit perfect around. I just added the diapers inside to create a circular form. So when you are filling these, um, you just kind of have to eyeball it and make sure that it, it stays in a circular form. That's the main goal that you want to achieve when making these. You want it to be a circle. Um, you know, essentially it's gonna look like a cake. So again, repeating the process with the ribbon, covering the rubber band, and of course making it look cute. I'm using a different style ribbon for the middle part just because I wanted to make it, um, you know, cuter and different. So what I'm doing is just um, securing the ribbon with pins. This is not how I'm going to leave it. I did go back in um, with my glue gun and just added a dot of glue to secure it. I wasn't going to leave the pins in there, you know, just for security purposes. And for the top layer, I'm so sorry guys that the camera angle just cut off the top layer but it's basically repeating the same process with the remaining diapers i used i think it was six diapers for the top layer and then um covering it with ribbon with the opposite ribbon so see how i did what i did here it's one style ribbon and then the opposite for the middle and then the same as a third layer for the top you know just to give it some cute some extra cuteness you don't have to do it this way. You can do all three layers with the same ribbon. This is totally up to you and the style that you are trying to achieve. So now we're in design space. I've been playing around with Cricut Design Space using my laptop. I usually use my iPad Pro for this, 
but the latest update has the offset feature which I love and I love the fact that you can choose how thin, how thick you want the offset to be. You can also add however many layers of the offset. I did three layers, well, you know, the name and then the second offset, third offset, just to give it some more, some more dimension, you know? So I'm just gonna cut this down to size. I ended up doing a five inch cake topper for the diaper cake and it fit perfectly. So here's the final look guys. I'm obsessed with the outcome. I added all the other details off camera and played around with the flowers. This part really depends on the look that you're going for. So if you guys liked it and enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.